Nice job, mates. We're safe now, thanks to you. But we won't make it long without food. If help don't come soon, we're gonna have to head to town. Meantime, maybe you could see if anybody needs help. Come over here. I've got a job for you. This baby needs some new spark plugs or she ain't going nowhere. Shame, though. It's a hell of a car. A battalion of those freaks wouldn't slow this baby down. So, if you can find me a few necessary parts from any nearby wrecked cars, and we get this ride rolling, I'll let you take her out anytime you want. Deal? Yeah. Excellent. You locate those parts. You know where to find me. Ah! I heard this scourge came from outer space. Hey, remember me, mate. I'm the doctor, but I can't do much without medical supplies. The door to the infirmary is locked from the other side, and Anne's in critical condition. You think you can help me break the bloody thing down? How can I say no? I appreciate it. Go on, then. Poor bastards. <laughs> won't go in there with those things still bumping around. Take him out. On you, mate. Now let me get to work. All the equipment's <laughs> trashed or gone. Like I never to Cindy, didn't Kelly, you. please, just calm down. Kelly's worried about her husband, Will, but I think he's probably okay. If you happen to be nearby there, can you see if you can find him? Yeah. His name is William. He's about six foot one, black hair, good looking. He's a concierge. He has a friend named Doyle who works in the Diamond District bungalows. I'm thinking maybe he's hiding out there.
Whoa, great job. Nice. Now just give me a sec and I'll get this bitch running. Jeez! What the hell happened here? <laughs> what a bloody disaster. Nothing here at all, is there? We need to think of another way. Will you help me? I need you to locate an ambulance or one of the lifeguard vehicles. Inside, you'll find a paramedic bag with all the necessary equipment in it. I'm pretty sure I saw one by the Diamond Bungalows. I can do that. Without your help, we'd all be six feet under by now. Bloody walking corpses. running like a dream. This ride is yours whenever you need it. <coughs> you just saved a lot of lives, mate. You may have even saved Anne's. Thank you.
Thank you. Man, I was fucked up. Oh shit, I'm out of here. You should be too. Fuck you, man! Everything is so fucked up. And these half-dead assholes, they're fucking annoying. I need more champagne. I fucking love champagne. Can you find some for me? You find me champagne, and I'll give you whatever I have. Whatever you want. I'm me. You like sweaty? Okay, baby, we're going to party. Now find me some champagne! I need shampoo, champagne, champagne. Give it to me, baby. <laughs> Where is my champagne? I want to fucking drink till I fucking drop. Max sent you to find me? I don't want to see her. I can't believe that crazy bitch sent someone to find me. The whole world's going to hell and the last person I want to be with is that goddamn wife of mine. Look, take the money and whatever else you want. It's no use to me anymore. And tell her... Tell her I'm dead. Believe me, it's for the best. Minor 
asshole! I was wrong. Thanks anyway. I appreciate the help. Feel like I'm back in fucking Iraq. These bodies are starting to rot. You smell that? We need to burn them before they start attracting more of these walking dead motherfuckers. Do me a favor. See if you can't get some gas from that station nearby. Let's do it. Okay, good. See if you can find a car. That way you can move more gas. A sec to open it. Come on, quick. You want gas? Uh, sorry, the pumps ain't working. Power's out and the generator's in the warehouse next door. Unfortunately, the front entrance is blocked. Yeah, maybe there's another way in. See, try the roof. That might work. Head out the back so they don't see you. And take some canisters with. Yo, know, once you get in, turn on the power and refuel those canisters. And now that we're here, we're not moving anywhere. It's too friggin' dangerous out there. What's in here?
Exhaust! Hurry it up. These... Hey, thank you. This should do it. By the way, I'm Mike. I got the bodies piled up outside. Guess we better do this. <laughs> <laughs> 